Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video of the Osmoth. Today, I uh, I recently, you know, a couple of minutes ago, probably like half an hour ago, I did a video on the uh, United States Navy tech tree, how that could be changed. Um, and someone on my previous, previous video on the Japanese tech tree asked me to do the British tech tree. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to figure out how the British tech tree could be assembled. Um, nothing's come out about the British tech tree, um, which is really disappointing. Um, but my best guess is it's probably going to be like HE focused or something like that, or by like you know faster rider shift, not sure. Anyway, we're going to get to the point. Um, I'm starting for like like tier five mostly, maybe tier four. I don't really focus on tier three because tier three is useless basically. Um, but I go from like tier 4 to tier 5 and then you know onwards to tier 10. So for tier 4 I believe that one of the better ships should be the... Give me a second let me just look through my book. Should be the um give me a second guys. Look. Just gonna look through. So I did do a video on this, uh like a couple of months ago, I think it was like a year ago. Um, I haven't really checked on it since. So the tier three HMS Dreadnought. So you, I uh, might as well just add that in. So Dreadnought, and I'm gonna actually color code um, the ships. So Dreadnought is gonna be red. So you know Dreadnought and battleships are gonna be red. Plus they're gonna be uh, bold as well. Uh, for tier 4, I believe that um, it could be cause 10 is 12, okay. 10 is 12. So, Orion, Orion, so Orion, and then for tier five could be the Iron Duke. For tier six, I think that the I think the um Iron Duke, Iron Duke oh, I don't know. Actually I might not do Iron Duke. I might do Actually no, I'll put Iron Duke in, and then for tier six we can do Queen. Um, Elizabeth. For tier seven. Um, We could add in the Actually when you think about it No because War Spite's already a premium isn't it? So coin uh, 
Wow, that queen and this. Zappa. Oh, I didn't put the spirit room. Uh, for tier 7, we could see the Valiant. Oh, Ant. Like Ant. For TV, I'm thinking. Um, because the Valiant is a better version of the Queen Elizabeth. For two ways, uh, if I just Um, Venge, your sovereign, more oak. So, the limits of the Queen Elizabeth class with productions in size is Okay. Uh, no, uh, the, this is the M3 class. Okay. Right, okay. So, oh, this is difficult. I'm thinking so Ramilies. So Ramilies, Ramilies is Ramilies. Three, four, five, six, eight. Um, the problem is, is I want to make this as the Dreadnought line, not like the fast battleship, but Dreadnought line. They all, they are all going to be similar ships. I'm thinking. Tier six. If we actually put the um, the um, what is it? Uh, Adjing core. So Adjun Court for tier 6, Queen Liz for tier 7, Valiant for tier 8, Ramilies for tier 9. So these are basically... Um, and then for tier 10, we could add the... We could add the... Um, Maybe the Nelson for tier 10. Okay. So then if we change the... Uh, 
They don't grass. Uh, if we change the color to say, so the red will be for dreadnoughts. Green will be fast battleships. No, blue will be fast battleships. So let's have a think here. So. Okay, so if we do it from Agincourt, so if we do the split from Agincourt, okay, so this is going to be the fast battleship one. Or the fast battleship split. So if we put Okay, that works. So we have the Canada and then have the Ugh no. oh. oh, nice. Um if we have oh this is gonna be difficult tier seven I don't want to put the hood because the hood is gonna be battle cruiser uh we could have the do you know what would fit well here do you know what would fit well is the vanguard and then the monarch. I think it's just monarch. And then the lion. And then finally the conqueror. Is this spell conqueror? U E R O R. Oh. Conqueror. Okay. And now we're gonna we're gonna do a green split. This time it's going to be from I'm just curious. Okay, there you go. So this time it's going to be the battle cruisers, and it's going to split off from the Iron Duke. I know that's a bit weird splitting off from the Iron Duke, but I don't want to split off from the Canada. Um, the Canada has ten 356 millimeter guns in five turrets, um, and she doesn't have a lot of armor, which makes her fast battleship. We are not really a dreadnought; she's like a fast battleship. So this is going to start out with the. Now, yeah. renown, and then the uh, um, re oh, I can't spell. Rep 
pulse and then the hood um, and then um, the um, oh God, what's going to be? the Anson and tier eight with nine four sixes. Yeah, I mean it could work. Tier nine, you could have the uh, Ajin Court again. And then tier 10, you can have the incomparable. incomparable. So you've got Dreadnought, Fast Battleships, and Battle Cruisers. Um, and then for premiums, we could have the. Well, we've already got the. Um, the War Spite. We'll make this like a gold color. Um, HMS Congo. So you've got HMS Congo, actually I might just colour them like in like maybe orange but they're a little bit easier to see. Um, tier 10 um, Hmm I'm thinking for cruisers. You could have the Colombo. So this will be that color. Colombo. Yeah, Colombo. So it's got five five inch guns. It's got like American. Oh no no, it's got eight four inch guns. I you apologize. Colombo has eight four inch guns. Tier four, we can have the Caladon. The Caladon. Caladon. And then for tier five, you could have the um Yeah. 
the um, the carrier the carrier class tier six you could have the the York tier seven you could see the Tier seven, you can see the the Kent. Tier eight, so this is heavy cruisers, by the way. To your right, you can have the London tier nine. You can have the um, what was it called? The God, I'm terrible with my ships. Drake. So, Drake. And if it's tier 10, you're going to have the. Let me have a look. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, Goliath. Goliath. Okay. So from the This will be purple. So from the Cario. So from the Cario, it will go um, and the. Uh, LD. So that'll be tier five, tier six. You will have most likely the H USA. Tier seven. You could maybe have the. The Liverpool, which has oh, hang on a minute. With sure. So if we actually change the Liverpool to the Swift Shore.
Liverpool. Um, tier nine. Mm, we could see. Belfast, tier 9, and if it's tier 10, you could have. Ooh, what could you take? Let's have a look. So Belfast is 12. I didn't. I don't know. URGH Edinburgh. Okay, there you go. So Right, this is interesting. So you've got the dreadnought line, you've got the fast battleship line, you've got the battle cruiser line, you've got the heavy cruiser line and the light cruiser line. Um you could have the AAA cruiser line. Like you know and things like that. There are a lot of cameras here. A lot of cameras. Right. So, this is what I believe the British line could look like. I could be wrong, but you know, this is what I think it could look like. So, again, I'm going to go over it again. The red is the dreadnought type battleship. Lots of armor, not that very accurate. Main guns, um, standard secondaries, uh, basically your standard battleship. And then the fast battleships could have enhanced secondaries. Um, they could have. Uh, uh, increased reload, less armor than your traditional, you know, battleship, but they'll be a lot quicker. And then the battle cruiser will be uh, very quick, not a lot of armor, uh, fast torture first, uh, not a lot of health. So the renowned of repulse the hood, the ants and the engine core, the incomparable will be very, very squishy. Um, but they'll have like uh, improved secondaries and uh, improved HG. And of course you've got the heavy cruisers which you know have the guns. The Drake and the Goliath have two thirty fours, the London has two oh threes, Kent has two oh threes, York has two oh threes, the Cario, the Caledon and the Colombo all have uh, the Colombo has four inch, the Caledon has five inch. Hang on, just to make sure I'm not talking out my ass. Uh, is Kent has eight eight inch guns. Uh, York has six eight inch. So York has six uh, two or threes. Kent has eight two or threes. London will have improved two or threes. Uh, Caledon has five six inch, and Cario has five six inch. I think Cario had yeah eight torpedoes in Bulldog Mountains. Caledon has 
eight torpedoes and double mountains. But Cario has more AA and better armor. That's good. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy this video, give a thumbs up. If you didn't enjoy this video, give a thumbs down. Put in the comment section, do you agree with my proposed British tech tree? Um, and if not, what would you change? Put it in the comment section below. I would love to hear your comments. Um, anyway guys, I'm going to see you later. Peace.